Hey guys, my name is Dan. I'm a veterinarian and vaccine reactions in the dog. Do vaccine reactions happen? How often do they happen? What to expect and how to move forward if they do happen? With vaccine reaction, guys, they do definitely happen. As a veterinarian, I vaccinate a ton of dogs and most of them have no problems at all. But if you are concerned about a vaccine reaction, you should always follow up with your veterinarian. Your veterinarian should go over what symptoms for a vaccine reaction look like, and they can be quite broad. Vaccine reactions usually will cause an allergic reaction of some sort. That may look like hives, red dots, a swollen face or a swollen muzzle. Maybe the eyes swell a little bit. Also guys, if you're seeing facial and skin irritation, you may also have intestinal or stomach upset too, because the stomach has histamine receptors too, which could be related to an allergic reaction. So you may see vomiting, you may see drooling, you may have nausea. These are all signs of a vaccine reaction, especially when they're happening hours after a vaccine. These are all more mild symptoms that need to be addressed and calling your veterinarian and getting back in for antihistamine injection, a steroid injection, and supportive care are really, really important. The more serious ones are when you have an anaphylactic reaction to the vaccine, and this can definitely happen. It's very rare, but what you're gonna notice is an incredibly lethargic dog. You may have all those other symptoms, but you have a really lethargic dog, maybe non-responsive, really cold, poor, poor, poor refill time on their on their gums. They're just lethargic, like I'll get out. And they just don't respond to you. They're just sluggish and weak. If that happens, that's a medical emergency and that dog you should be seen by a veterinarian ASAP. A veterinarian will definitely place an IV catheter. They will give antihistamines and steroids. They will, they will definitely do supportive care with fluids, emergency fluids, maybe even emergency medicines, and also different things to make sure the dog is warm and comfortable. You should always call your veterinarian if you're ever worried about a vaccine reaction. I tell all my clients what to look for for a vaccine reaction, and if they do have one, they need to just call me or come back in. You should never go home, guys, and sit there on an island by yourself and be like, I think my dog's okay. If you're ever worried, just come back in. I think people come back in and it's not a vaccine reaction, but I don't care. I want to make sure the dog is comfortable because I take responsibility for that doggy or that kitty when they come into the hospital and see me for the preventative care. I want to make sure that they are happy and healthy and what I did makes them happier and healthier. All right guys, hope that was crazy helpful. If your doggy or your kitty ever has a vaccine reaction, those should be reported to the vaccine companies. That way, we can have better vaccines out there and safer vaccines as we move forward. As always guys, my name is Dan. I'm a veterinarian. I appreciate you guys watching. If you wouldn't mind sharing, liking, subscribing, it's all free and it greatly helps the channel. You guys take care, bye.